I'm Gary Hodge, Dean of Social and Behavioral Sciences at Collin College and Administrative Liaison for the Dignity Initiative. 20% of all sex trafficking nationally occurs in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. We encourage you to become aware of this and other issues regarding violence and exploitation of women by checking out our website, attending future events, and taking the pledge. Violence against women and girls makes its hideous imprint on every continent, country, and culture. It is time to focus on the concrete actions that all of us can and must take to prevent and eliminate this scourge. It is time to break through the walls of silence and make legal norms a reality in women's lives. The central moral challenge of this century is gender inequality and the oppression of women and girls throughout the world. I took the pledge. I took the pledge. I took the pledge. Today, Women around the world are the victims of violence and oppression in many aspects of their lives. This victimization includes women in Texas, as well as in Collin County. In support of our core values, the Collin College Committee Against Gender Violence and Oppression is initiating a district-wide campaign, the Dignity Initiative, from violence to dignity, evolving through action, to educate and involve students, faculty, staff, and the community in an effort to end the violence and the oppression of women. Our mission is to affirm one vision of dignity, the respectful treatment of women while honoring their role as valued members of all cultures around the world. I took the pledge. I took the pledge. I took the pledge. Each semester, we will focus on one aspect of violence and oppression that violate women's safety and humanity, beginning with victimizer roles and responsibilities, focusing on the role that the victimizer plays in perpetuating the violence, followed by the objectification of women, focusing on the negative portrayal of women in the media, music, and advertising, sex trafficking, focusing on sex slavery and forced prostitution, gender violence, focusing on physical, sexual, psychological, and emotional abuse and global impact of oppression, focusing on the economic impact and the role that education plays in ending gender oppression and in equitable treatment in the home, community, and culture. I took the pledge. I took the pledge. I took the pledge. The second aspect of the campaign will identify three calls to action that are necessary to end the oppression of women. We are asking students, faculty, staff, and the community to support this effort and take the pledge to step up and support women who are the victims of violence and who are being bullied, abused, and harmed. Speak out and use your voices against the mistreatment, oppression, and limiting representations of women. And to act now to stop the violence and the oppression of women. I took the pledge. I took the pledge. I took the pledge. In an effort to support the campaign throughout the district, the Collin Committee has scheduled events at each campus, beginning with Walking the Path of Dignity at the Spring Creek campus. Other events include film screenings, panel discussions, speaker presentations, the White Ribbon Rally, a Dance for Dignity, and a Reader's Theater production. For additional information about each event, visit our website, look for posters with a schedule of events, and watch for district-wide emails. With your help, we can make a difference. Please join us in this effort to end the violence and the oppression of women. We've taken the pledge. We're asking for you to take the pledge too. I took the pledge. I took the pledge. I took the pledge. I encourage you to join me in taking the pledge to step up, speak out, and act now to end the violence and oppression of women. Thank you.